So once I got to my town in China in March 1997, one thing was brought to my attention and for the next three years was quite often brought to my attention. How different I actually was. Um, in my city of half a million people, I spent three years uh, being told quite often that I was a foreigner. Uh, people would point to me in the street and they would say, hello foreigner, or there's a foreigner. Now, none of it was meant in a bad way, none of it was meant to make me feel bad. It was just that all these people at the time were very surprised to see a foreigner in my city. Now, there was one extreme case where I really did realize that I was probably quite different to everyone else around me. And that was on a train, funnily enough. So one day I'm sat on a train, reading a book, minding my own business. I'm in the carriage of uh, sleeper bunks, there's about a hundred people around me. And then this woman comes in and she's carrying a small child. Don't think much of it, lots of people traveling, lots of people have children. Everything's fine until she actually gets near me and her small child notices the strange foreigner sitting at the window. And her immediate reaction was to start screaming and screaming and screaming and not stopping. Eventually, the mother had to take the child away to the next carriage to calm her down. A few people were chuckling about this and I thought, well, yes, I am a foreigner in China. What? I should expect this. But what I didn't expect was when the woman came back half an hour later with the child again and it happened again and again and again until the point was the whole carriage of over a hundred people were laughing at the small child being afraid of the strange foreigner sat in the window. Now that taught me something very very important that I was different and people saw me differently and it forced me to reassess my view of my place in the world that we tend to believe in ourselves and our view is the one that matters, but all those people around you will have a very different viewpoint. And it helps you understand that you need to understand others and the way they see the world and the way they see you. Now sometimes my students here at Prague College have told me that you know, they come to Czech Republic and it's very different to what they're used to at home. They sometimes tell me they're even made to feel a little bit different. My advice is, don't let it bother you. Understand that they're seeing, coming from a very different perspective, they're seeing you through their eyes, they're not seeing you through your eyes. If you can accept that, then when you go abroad, anywhere abroad, your experience will be much better, much more rewarding. And some of the frustrations you may feel about being in a new place or being treated differently or as I was, as a very scary figure for a small child, won't bother you at all.